What's good, family? It's your boy, Rich Long, and I'm just here to keep it real. Okay, breaking news. Breaking motherfucking news. The Dallas OG that just talked to us earlier on our first interview, maybe our first and last interview with him, I don't know. Only God knows. This man is pulling Duke Farrell on us. He's pulling a Duke Farrell on us. Okay, Duke Farrell and Most Hated Blogger just had an exchange of words yesterday. After it seemed that they was on the same page. After it seemed they was on the same page and the same side. Okay. This man immediately, you know what I'm saying, I guess, after seeing that that video is about to do numbers. That might have been how he feel. He feel like that video finna do numbers. He called me. And the man, uh, uh, he, he first, he said he want me to edit the video. Because he say too much. He said too much. Which... Okay, you know what I'm saying? That's not out of the realm of uh, possibilities. I, I can do that. That's nothing. But I'm in a cliff right then. You know what I'm saying? I'm, 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 I'm riding. I'm finna go whatever. Whatever I'm finna do. I'm, I'm doing that. Okay, I tell him, wait till I get to the house and I can edit it. Which, what the fuck I got a lot of you for? Just let me get to the house. I'm on the freeway. I'm not finna do that while I'm on the freeway. Okay? Boom. Uh... He he called me and he texted me. He's called he called me, he texted me. Uh when I took his call, he explained to me what was going on. We talked for about 20 minutes. Okay, he he, he really was kind of getting on my motherfucking nerves just a little bit because the the respect level uh it was being lost. Because uh uh for one, he wanted to drive home the point that he got his own bag he's trying to grab. He's a musician. I listen to his music. It sounds good. More power to you. I fuck with it. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I wanted to play uh, his song on here, which I might still do that. I might still do that. I got to see. I got to see. You know what I'm saying? I got to see what's up with the nigga. He calling me right now. He calling me right now. You know what I'm saying? And the only reason why I'm not answering it, bro, if you see this video, is because the respect level started dwindling. And one thing I know about black people... We'll have a nigga moment. <laughs> Black people believe in having a nigga moment. And if you felt like you wasn't getting your way right then at that time, I already know what that means. Oh, this nigga finna start tripping. He's fit to have a fit, which is what you're doing right now, nigga. You know what I'm saying? That's what you're doing right now. I didn't I didn't tell you to, hey, call me and do this interview. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad you did. I'm glad you did, man. Because I got something out of that. You know what I got out of it? It wasn't about the views. I got a deeper insight in to this whole uh, situation. Because I care, nigga. That's why I'm doing this. Because I care, nigga. I've lost loved ones out here. Not not, not just to, uh, 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 to, to the violence, gun violence. But just to this world. To this wicked world, nigga. I, I, I'm, I'm a deeply uh, uh, involved person. I'm involved in my community. I have a non-profit organization where I go feed people out of my pocket. It's called keeping people warm. Okay? Now, that's just for you to get a little insight on what type of nigga I am. I don't want no pat on the back for that. That's just how I'm built. You know what I'm saying? My whole life, that's just how I've been. So, when you telling me shit like uh, you bloggers, you like Vlad TV, you doing this for clout. Bitch, that nigga, for one, I ain't no white Jewish man. I can never be like Vlad TV. I live in the hood. When I go outside and look, oh, what's my surroundings? It's not no whole bunch of, uh, uh, uh. It, it, hell, I don't, I don't even, <laughs> I don't even understand what a comparison come into outside of a computer. But one thing about me, you know what I'm saying? I'm me and I'm genuine, my nigga. I try to get some understanding out of the situation. It still can be understanding, mate. Because, uh, 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 we, we, if we grown, you know what I mean? If we grown, it can always be understanding, mate. But where, where, where the misunderstanding come is everyone got to be respected at all times. Now, man, if you drop the ball, because I did, not only did I give you my intentions in this uh, email. Let me let me move this. I had to record this twice because I didn't accidentally show your number. See, I showed your number from the email earlier. I'm not going, you know what I mean? I don't know that type of time, nigga. And even though I always nothing to me, I get my number changed. I already know how you niggas don't respond. Cause you, you know what I mean? Boom. So I say, can I call you? You know what I mean? You say, uh, yeah, I'm getting my feet done with my wife. Send your number. I'm getting my feet done with my wife. Send your number. I say, bet that. 
We gonna do a viral interview. I'm learning how to make them hoes boom. You know what I'm saying? You calling me right now, man. But look, I just gotta say this. I gotta, I gotta finish what I'm saying because this is our problem. This is our problem. We got different objectives as black people, and when somebody objective, when they feel like, well, my objective ain't taking a front seat. You know what I mean? It's, it, it it immediately become friction. It immediately become friction. It immediately become friction. Like real shit. And I could give a fuck. But what I'm saying is, I'm not going to sit up and do no yelling over the phone and arguing. You know what I mean? I ain't going to do no yelling over the phone and arguing, bro. Even though we wasn't arguing, but you was doing a lot of loud talking and yelling. You know what I mean? That's annoying, my nigga. Then, this is where you really fucked up with me. Because I'm tired of people pulling that shit with me. That's why I don't care about telling the truth uh, on niggas when they reveal the truth on themselves. Because niggas legit try to put me in cases that I ain't even, I ain't even did shit. Niggas do this all... <laughs> I, I, I'm not even just speaking for me. This happens to black people all the time. You have niggas fighting cases this bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Just because somebody put it on, on you. Just cause they can, and in the state of Texas, they picked up. They pick up all the cases. They any case that a motherfucker pick up on you, they gonna prosecute that motherfucker, and you have to fight it. You just gotta fight it. You guilty until you prove it innocent. You know what I'm saying? I know this judicial system. I've been fighting this motherfucker since I was 16 years old. So when I see niggas that get away with murder, just get away with murder. You know what I'm saying? Over and over and over again. Like nigga, how's you? How the fuck do you get a bond, bitch? I get it. I, I get. I get the feeling that type of way because I love us for real. I love us for real. So if you called me earlier and you felt like if you felt like I was doing anything other than being motivated by the spirit, because I want Mo Three's killers. I want them to be brought to justice, nigga. <coughs> That's the only thing I'm motivated by. <coughs> That's why I say <coughs> it's a misunderstanding somewhere in there. You know what I'm saying? Not. Not to say that an uh, understanding can't be brought into the situation. But here, here where the, the major malfunction came. When you say, since I already know you're not going to take it down. Let me see if y'all can see this. Since I already know you're not going to take it down, you're going to get your lawyer involved. That's what you said to me. Nigga. I don't give a fuck about no lawyer, nigga. Because me and you, you know what I'm saying? We really don't even know each other anyways. So it's not, it's not on no. You, you fucking with a smart nigga, bro. That's what you don't realize. I'm smart in a bitch. You know what I'm saying? If anybody from Fort Worth have ever, if, if, if it's people from Fort Worth who know my face, because y'all don't know my name. If y'all do, y'all don't know me like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about uh, most of the, the niggas who I see in passing. One thing that a motherfucker is never going to tell you is that I'm dumb, bro. So when you say that, that make me feel like, uh, that, that make me feel a way. That make me feel like you don't get it, my nigga. You don't get it. You don't get it. But you talented, my nigga. You talented in a motherfucker. And I do believe that your music <coughs> will do numbers. <coughs> With the right exposure, of course. <coughs> So I was all with you when you say you don't want to uh you don't want to start a beef and that be your exposure. You don't want a rap beef to be your exposure because you know you got talent. It shouldn't be. But you from what you were saying in that conversation, shit, you ain't said shit wrong. You ain't said shit wrong. And if 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 you feel like I'm wrong, that's fine, man. I get it. That's fine, my nigga. I get it. But I'm going to put it to you like this, bro. Sometimes people have to agree to disagree. I, I can make the offer again to, to edit the video, and we can do the interview the right way. We can do the interview the right way. But I want you to come on here and do an interview with me tonight. And, 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 and go a little bit deeper into what... uh uh uh. It don't gotta be about this shit. You know what I'm saying? It can it can be about some other things. But what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to get the uh the insider information 
on what is causing these niggas to go around committing these goddamn murders. I want to know why they blew that lady leg up. I want to know why Miss Gloria was killed. Like, bro, I'm not, I'm not, fuck a clown. You know what I'm saying? Fuck a clown. If you go look at my other videos that's not booming, it's, it's not on no clown. It's not on no clown. Period. It's not on that. And then y'all need to stop saying that. Y'all, y'all. Y'all don't understand uh, what, what shit is out here. Y'all just say that shit because Kanika Jenkins, them, during her investigation, they got that shit all clout, clout, uh, whatever. Man, some shit just is what it is. Some shit just is what it is. And really, it's not that big of a miscommunication. I really feel like somebody got to you, man. I'm trying to be respectful because, you know, I, I do feel that that's the foot that I need to lead with when I'm dealing with with our people until until you can't leave with it no more i try to leave with respect until until you see that this motherfucker ain't do no respect shit freddie them not do no respect rainwater ain't do no respect the niggas are crooked you know what i'm saying and then you come over here and confirm that he's a snitch you not okay you um uh when you got when you rap and shit nigga we all rappers nigga i'm a rapper I'm a rapper, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I get what you're saying, but it's like you you don't get what you're saying, bro. You don't get what you're saying. You know what I'm saying? And then and then maybe you ain't know what you was getting yourself into fucking with real shit. You supposed to be real. You supposed to be real, nigga. And what you did was real. When you said that shit, that was real shit. You know what I'm saying? I don't even know what would make you go back on it. Don't go back on that shit, nigga. Leave that shit how it is, nigga. Now, if you feel like the shit wasn't done the right way, let's do it the right way then, nigga. Because you already know, you know what I'm saying? It, it's another reason behind why you want it took down. It, it's not because of... I truly believe somebody saw that shit and you, you don't want to look like no snitch. Stop with that bullshit, y'all. Fuck how you look to other niggas. If a nigga snitched on you... It, <coughs> Like, damn, you can't even say nigga snitched on you. I don't even, I don't even understand. I don't even understand what you was even saying, bro. Really, that's that's really why I'm even making this video. You know what I'm saying? I don't understand where you coming from, to keep it real, my nigga. I, I want to understand. But then, I'm going to be real. I'm going to be real with you. When I get on this phone, if you yelling in my ear again, we won't have no understanding. And I fuck with you. I fuck with you for being real. You know what I mean? I don't know you. I don't even really have an understanding about who you is good, bro. That's what you also got to understand. You can't come demanding. I told you what the fuck I was doing. I'm handling business. That's why I asked for the interview. You gave me the interview. The motherfucker was up for over an hour. It was much over an hour, bro. And then once it started doing a little bit of numbers, because it matched the algorithm, like I was telling you, whatever, whatever, you know, so I'm even hipping you the free game, but you can you can get that on your own. You know what I'm saying? But I'm saying never never say Rich Long did it for clout. Never say Rich Long doing anything other than doing Rich Long. I act like this everywhere I go, nigga. I'm like this in real time. If you see me, I'm like this, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't even know, my nigga. I think I think we get too confused. We don't know what's real and what's fake. This this right here is authentic. You know what I'm saying? This is authentic, my nigga. Real nigga. You know what I mean? Not real by society standards of uh, this, 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 and that. I'm going to keep it real with you. Period. I don't have no shame in my game. I ain't went out here and did nothing that I'm ashamed to speak on. You know what I'm saying? Honestly. Honestly, man. If I did that, I'm going to say that. You know what I'm saying? And I need you, I need you to, to, to understand, man, that we're here to keep it real. We're here to keep it real, my nigga. Don't, don't, don't get it confused, my nigga. I fuck with you. We can redo the interview. I or you know what I'm saying? Or we can say fuck. I really don't give a fuck. I really don't give a fuck. But I, I do I do feel like I do feel like uh that this not gonna be the last time that we discuss this and cross this bridge. That's why I'm 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 talking to you about it. In a good way. In a good way. Because me and you going to sit down. 
and we gonna rap about it. But I'm not taking it down until until we 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 have some type of conversation about it to replace it. You know what I'm saying? Because why not? You know what I mean? Why not? Why not come on here and do the same thing you did but better? If you talk about nothing for nothing, fuck it. Just because this is my time and my energy, bro. I'm going to just be real with you. This is my time and my energy. You know how much... How much motherfucking uh, 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 time that I already take just doing this shit. Not not for... for no, this is not for the many. This is for the few. The shit that I, I'm talking about. Because y'all... You caught this because of clout. You, see, you caught me and subscribed to me because of clout, bro. You know what I'm saying? Really, you don't even know. I got a ministry. You know what I'm saying? I have a whole ministry. Rich, long ministries. Like, you you, you just, you don't even understand, my nigga. You don't even understand. Good nigga right here. Good nigga right here, bro. Good nigga right here. You know what I'm saying? I speak blessings over your life. I mean, don't, 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 don't get it twisted. I speak blessings over your life. For as long as, as you aren't an enemy, I speak blessings over your life. You know what I'm saying? And, and I speak positivity. So whatever you doing, my nigga. Because the conversation we had, I can hear it in you. You hungry, you finna get out here and eat. Period. You know what I'm saying? Period. But back to the business. I'm finna drop something for y'all. Another hit. In a few motherfucking minutes. So I need y'all to tune in. What time is it? In 15 minutes at 6 o'clock. Tune in at 6 o'clock and check out the next video after this one. You don't want to miss it. Trust me.